friendship is 8-bit. It really is. The other day I was all talking to my friend and I was like, 257? And he was like, error, overflow. Okay, that was a terrible joke. Let's play this game. Friendship is 8-bit. A story of the blanks. A flash game by Donuts. Or Donuts. However you pronounce that. Anyway, this is a game somebody requested like two freaking months ago. It's apparently my duty now to play all spooky pony games. Though allegedly this one is actually spooky instead of just, Oh my gosh, I posted a picture of Pinkie Pie. Ha ha ha. You suck. Which is pretty much a concise description of what the last game was. Anyway. If you're telling me Z to interact, you should really give me something to interact with on the screen. But you didn't, so... I can't learn that interface element because you didn't give me a way to test it. Just saying. Okay, let's interact with that screen. Oh, crap. It's you. Evening, Apple Bloom. What are you doing out here on your own? Hey, Twilight. You'll never guess what we did today. So this morning... That's okay, Apple Bloom. I just... But then Scootaloo was like CMC Park Rangers. Oh, man. Do a hillbilly accent very well. I suppose I should do the female voice for Mrs. Female Person here. Well, I'm sure you. And then blah 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 I promised Sakura to bring her some books on local herbs and lacks of trailing periods. But I'd better hurry. I'd rather get home before dark. Oh, oh, can I come to you? I'm sorry, Apple Bloom, but my voice changed. The Everfree Forest is no place for little Philly. I'll be extra careful, y'all. Oh, please, oh, please. I don't think. Please. All right, all right. But you must promise to stay close at all times. Thank you, Twilight. Let's go, let's go. Yes, yeah, your time. Let's dance. I'm so happy and I'm so excited. Yeah. I can walk forward while walking side to side. I'm so happy. I'm so happy I only move in I move in eight directions, but my sprite is only animated in four. Yeah, look at that. Woo. Pony dance party. It's not really much else to do at the moment. Dance party. Sort of Zelda ish music going on here. I do like the aesthetic of this one a lot more. You know, it's very fitting for what it is. It stylistically, I vastly, I approve of this one vastly more than the last one. Hey, Zakora, we brought the books you wanted. Kind ponies, I thank you for delivering what's told. That's that's not a sentence, Zakora. We had this conversation. You have to make sentences with your words. Glad to help. But you do not want to remain for the events that will unfold. Hurry back to Ponyville, you two must. For the darkness you cannot trust. Oh snap, you're one of those rhymey types. I get it. I get it. Well, what the hate does that mean? Spittoo. I do not know what this is about, but we must go. Come on, Apple Bloom. I only have one female voice, and I can't even keep it straight. Oh well. It's dance party time. Dance party. Oh yeah. What the? How in the heck? How in Equestria did this tree fall? That is a terrible voice. Maybe it was ghosts. I don't know how to say that with a hillbilly accent. I need to brush up with my accents. Oh, silly. There's no such thing as ghosts. We're talking effeminately now, like this. Never mind. I'll move it. <sighs> you know, you're, you're, a, you're a horse. You can just jump over that. Like, absolutely no problem. And how did you just move a frickin' gigantic tree? Oh, well. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, come on! Stay right there, Apple Bloom. I like that the face was actually kind of... Well, not animated, but there's a different face for that. That was very nice. This may take a while. Well, I guess that means we gotta run off into the dark forest all alone. Because we're a hillbilly. And we don't know any better. Yeehaw! Oh, hey, it's a random mother pony. Let's follow them to the horrible wilderness and get horribly murdered. Excellent. Hello? Where are y'all? 
she you this sure is a dark forest over here I sure done hope no grits and turkey gravy gonna eat my face I don't even know what what do southern people eat I, I don't even know how to offend them properly I'm sorry well this certainly isn't going to murder us this seems like a perfectly acceptable place to be Yes, it is, Parker. Calm down. But I do like this. Relatively, this is much spookier than uh, Parker Hush, than the uh, allegedly spooky Luna game with random screamers that aren't really very random. Ha ha! Why, hello there, little filly. Welcome to Sunny Town, the completely non-creepy place that is not filled with pedophiles. Uh, thanks. But just who are you, anyhow? Gray hoof at your service. Celebration planner extraordinaire and totally not a rapist. I just thought I would mention that. The party just started. It's not a rape party, if that's what you're concerned about. It's also not a murder party or a dismemberment party, so please stay and look over there. Help yourself to the food and drinks that are totally not spiked. Excellent, let's let's drink this Kool-Aid here. Oh, I can't seem to drink the Kool-Aid. That is unfortunate. It is not often we get visitors here. Enjoy your stay. He hasn't said a word to me all night. Sigh. I guess that was supposed to be female. Oh well. Dot, dot, dot. Hello. What's wrong, y'all? Oh, nothing. Fine, I'll tell you. You look kind of like Fry. With blue hair. The pony is over... The pony over there is Starlet. I was going to give her a gift tonight, but I shoved it up my face. But I lost it. Nowhere to be found. It was so pretty, too. So pretty it did not justify a period. Oh well. I'm sure that won't matter. Let's just talk to this brown thing. Hey, how come y'all don't have no cutie marks around here? Cutie what's? Sorry, little filly. I have no idea what you're talking about. Drink some of this Kool-Aid. It is delicious. Spooky well that is randomly colored, oddly. And note how that's, the woods are still all spooky. Quest item. Do 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 do. Oh, something sure is sticking out of this dirt here. Oh, just a red gem. I sure done hope it was a Confederate flag or something. That sure will be better. I didn't know there lived any pony. I didn't know there lived any ponies in the ever-free forest. That's, that's not how you form a sentence, Apple Bloom. Am I going have to get, have to get the baseball bat of encouragement again? You were not the first visitor to say that, or the first visitor to die mysteriously. We got everything we need right here, so we rarely ever leave. Well, that certainly doesn't sound insular and terrifying. Let's go give this gem back to that dude. I assume it's a dude. Mr. Romeo. It's kind of like Romeo, but misspelled terribly. You found it. Right, this guy's kind of laid back. It's not a good voice around. Huh? The jam? Sure, y'all can have it, I guess. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Ah! Don't push me around, you jerk. That's sexual harassment. What's going on here? Ah! I disappeared! Oh, Romeo, you shouldn't have. Your love is enough. Thank you. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is not an appropriate response to that statement. Okay, I guess she was talking to him and he was talking to me. That was that was an awkward statement. Or maybe he's just completely oblivious to the situation at hand. She's like, oh, Romeo, I love you. It's like, thanks! I know! Anyway, let's just continue on. I'm sure nothing will murder us. Oh, hey, spookiness. We're back to the spookiness. Woo, spooky. Spooky. Darn it, this door is locked. We'll break it down or something. Got some nice blinds here. We got a spooky well. I can sure done see something shining down this here well now. I can lift it up in the bucket, but the crank is gone. Oh, we're looking for cranks, are we? Oh, so we're in Resident Evil now? Is that where this is gone? Huh? Well, that's just great. We gotta go find a crank, I guess. 
then we can go find the key card and stick it in the key door, and then the zombie sharks will try to eat our feet, but then we'll get the grenade launcher, and I don't know where I'm going with this. Well, let's see if we can steal stuff from people's houses. Of course, we can't break into this house, you know. Pretty much 80% of classic video games, you know, with maps like this, ooh, is breaking into people's houses and stealing their stuff, so. We've got a classic Zelda block puzzle here. The one that's... Actually, I'm not sure if it's possible to fail this one. I guess you could push that first block here too far and then be stuck, but that's pretty much the only way you could get stuck, so that's very easy. A crank? Now what am I supposed to do with this? This isn't a confederate flag at all. It is not right! It is not right! It's the same thing again and again and again. Well, that's kind of weird and creepy. What are you doing just sitting here and crying? That's disconcerting, to say the least. But I guess I'll just leave you here to writhe in your misery, because I'm an unfeeling, terrible southern person. But we got our crank, so... Let's go back to the Umbrella Mansion and, uh... Open some grates, or whatever the crap they used cranks for. I don't actually remember enough of Resident Evil 1 to reference anything specific. I do know they sure love their cranks, and their key cards, and their keys. And random other generic puzzle objects. I sure done see something shining down that thar well there. Apple Bloom whiffs that thar bucket real well. It's a rusty okay. Yeehaw. Yeah. Well, that's not foreboding or terrifying at all. Let's just stay away from the horrifying fireplace that will surely murder us. Um, oh, who am I kidding? Where'd she go? Did she boil herself alive in this here furnace? Nothing in here. Nothing but... Oh, whoa. Hello, random skeleton and horror. What are you doing here? Um, no, 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 no! This isn't my Civil War reenactment at all. No, run! That wasn't terrifying at all. Now the blinds are red. Which is just wrong, because look how much they clash now. They clashed before, but this is even worse. This this will never do. Let's go back to town and tell them we ruined the interior decorating. Oh. God. Someone blow on the cartridge. Everything will be okay. Just, just blow on the cartridge. Everything will be fine. We have not entered Glitch Town. There was no other way. She was going to spoil the party. Now that's not disturbing. I'm thinking Grey Hoof was one of the ponies we already met, but oh god. Please don't murder me. The curse has befallen her this very night. Please don't eat me. She had the mark. She had to go. I'm just gonna step around you now. Oh god, Cthulhu pony! Oh my god, Cthulhu, please don't eat me. Please stay with us. We will never let the same happen to you. Somehow, I don't trust you. Mr. Cthulhu Pony. Oh, hey, you can move that thing. Well, I know what we're doing next. And that is not being eaten by the Cthulhu Pony. I do not enjoy that at all. Let's just put this rock out of the way here. Haha, <laughs> you're a noob, you can't even walk across. Oh god, that thing is fast. Oh god, that thing is... What? Hacks! I call hacks! WTF. No, okay, okay, stay over there. Hacks! I called hacks, you can't kill me. Don't worry. We will never be... You will never become like her. We will protect you. Forever! And then we died. Try again. You know, there wasn't really an option when you said try again. Just saying. Well, let's just pretend none of that happened, and take our pills like we should have this morning, and none of this would have ever happened. Dun dun dun. 
Yes, yes, we've seen you before. You're screwed up and we don't like you. Please don't murder me. Let's just make a beeline for this boulder thing here. Push that boulder out of the way. Please stay with us, blah blah blah. Nope. Not buying what you're selling. Okay, let's just run. Let's just run! Oh my god, it's so fast. Why are you... No. No. Can we go in this creepy house? No, we can't. That's unfortunate. Don't look back! What are you doing, you idiot? We have come to be spooky and stand in a line. All we want is friendship. And murder. But mostly friendship. Don't leave. The others won't like it. I, I don't trust you, Mr. Tentacle hanging out of your mouth. I'm just gonna run. Oh god, please don't murder me. Fools. Oh hey, it's the one that was crying. Even in death, they do not understand. <gasps> Zombie ponies! I should have protected her, but I made my choice. It was stupid. This is our everlasting punishment. What we deserve. Now run. Run for your life. Okay. If I touched you, do I die? Oh god, it looks at me. Let's let's pretend I never... Oh god. Look over here. Oh god. No, stop looking at me. That was kind of freaky, actually. Oh, whoa. That's... Oh. God. Um. Um. Ah! Don't worry. You will never... Oh, the same crap was before. I thought it would be something different. Try again. Okay. For 8-bit kind of stuff, they really do a good job of making this pretty spooky for what she is. I really like this one a lot more than the stupid Screamer game, I must say. And these, you know, for what they're working with, these are some pretty damn nice scary sprites. They're usually using two colors instead of you know, what they could be using, but... It's still pretty awesome for what they're doing. Let's walk along this giant zipper. It's unnamed gray pony from before. I am sorry. I didn't mean to bring you into this. My eyes are really spooky. But I was just curious. Don't be sad, y'all. I don't blame y'all know how. Oh god. You really should blame her. And run. Your cutie mark. Magnifying glass? That's from one of them science type things. Mm hmm I don't trust them sites. Sorts. Turns out I'm really good at finding things. I finally understand what it means. Does it mean you're going to dismember me? Please don't let that mean you're... Oh god, you're smiling. You're gonna murder me, aren't you? And I will find you a way out of this, oh god. You're gonna murder me. Someone help. Please don't murder me. Deus Ex Machina, activate! Yeah! Thanks, Twilight. Apple Bloom, oh Apple Bloom. Thanks, Enlisty, I found you. Twi! Let's get out of this creepy place. No wonder lurks in here. Well, I do, but, you know. Note the little spooky faces on the trees. That's a nice touch I didn't notice until now. Flee! Run! And continue fleeing. See you later, friend. I would rather never see you again. Oh god, Pink. Throughout the quest around relics of the past lay forgotten and alone. Most of them pink. I, bleedingly pink. Never truly resting in their pinkness. Awaiting recognition. The end. Of pink. Now wait, there's still some pink. But this was Friendship is 8-Bit. Alternately titled Story of the Blanks. And it was by Donuts. Or Donuts. Done. I don't know. Anyway, for for what it was, you know, eight bit spooky type game, pretty friggin' awesome. Um, no, not quite. I, I the only spooky eight bit game I can actually think of are Sweet Home and Monster Party, and Monster Party is more silly than anything. So this was pretty well done. I really liked it, especially relative to the other allegedly spooky pony games that people keep making me play, even though it's just, you know, an artificial layer of game and then Screamer at the end and then the same old crap. 
anyway, this has been this game.